I'm back in Cuba's mangrove swamps, a mysterious world of light and shadow, where a mixture of salt and fresh water is fed by ocean tides and river estuaries. All sorts of creatures are to be found. Both outside and inside the water. Of course, given his impressive dimensions, our protagonist is sure to be found. Where could he possibly hide? A voracious manatee combs the area for nourishment, propelled by its enormous fin. Just 10% of its body weight in food will satisfy its hunger. Of course, we're talking about a mere 150 pounds of food a day. No worry, that's just about 200 heads of lettuce. A group of fish escorts the manatee, since everywhere it goes, it stirs up the seabed. This also helps keep the canals free of vegetation. Of course, it's better not to get in the manatee's way. These peaceful creatures live underwater, but periodically come up to breathe. Legend has it that Christopher Columbus sighted them in 1492, and in his astonishment, he confused them with the mermaids described by Herodotus. Mermaids indeed, genuine mermaids. Well, no, I guess not.